We're here at the ministry resources table for Heart of America Prison Ministries, and we're at a conference. And while we were here, we discovered a former prisoner by the name of Rich Brown who received a leather-bound Bible through Heart of America Prison Ministries over a decade ago. He's got over 10,000 hours in the Word, and his life was changed by the Lord Jesus Christ through Heart of America Prison Ministries and your donations, changing lives one Bible at a time. Rich, would you share with us what happened behind bars for you? I'd just like to share my story, you know, a living testimony of what, what can happen when you give money to for a Bible. You know, the, the prisoners have nothing but time there. And what, what I did with mine is I took and I read the Bible night and day for over six and a half years. And this, this changed my life. When I got out, you know, I started my own business. I've never left reading the Word of God. And it's, it's, it's not, you hear the testimony of so many prisoners going back to prison. Well, that's not my case, you know, and, and I give the credit to Jesus Christ through the Word of God. So I just want to encourage you to give, you know, give to this ministry because it does make a difference. And, and, and not just my testimony, I have three, three other men that come to my church that are they're strong in the Lord still. They have, they're not living their old ways. There is a change, and it's by the Word of God. So the best thing that you can do is plant in this ministry so that other lives can be changed. Amen. Thank you. This is what the Bible looks like when it arrives to the prisoner. It's nice, pretty with uh, gold leaf, all the lights, bells, and whistles. This happens to be a Blackaby Study Bible. They retail at $59.95. And uh, this is what they look like after prisoners got a hold of them. And the difference between a prisoner with a leather-bound Bible who got on a waiting list and got a Bible in the mail with time on his hands versus the average civilian in a church in a westernized culture in America is a prisoner actually reads his. How many hours were you in the Bible the first year? The first year I was in my Bible from 5 in the morning till midnight. Just, just the only time I'd stop is just to eat. So. If you weren't fasting. Exactly. Seeking the Lord. So exactly. he's been out for eight years. He's got his own business. He pastors a congregation in Davenport that came up out of nowhere. The Lord just brought all the people. And you're growing and glowing because the Lord made a change in your life through a Bible. Heart of America Prison Ministry is changing life. One Bible at a time. Living testimony. Yeah. And they're all over America. I was in prison and you came unto me. Uh, yeah. God bless you. Yeah. Thank you for everything you do.